Okay, so I've got this little bag here, little crossbody thing. It's got a really long strap that you can actually adjust. It's got three little holes in it. Oh, it's got more than three, I guess. Helps if I can count. It's got five. So anyway, I haven't used this for anything yet, but I think it's kind of cute. It's got these little tassels on the zippers for this little bottom pouch. And the inside design is just nice little stripes. It's got that pouch there. And then up here, I've got the big spot that's got two little pouches here that don't have zippers for stuffing things in. And then one here is a zipper pouch for more stuff. It seems to be pretty good quality construction. Um, I haven't gone over it too thoroughly. There's a few areas where it's kind of wonky looking, but it really, I mean, it's fairly low priced, so obviously it's not like top of the line, but it's nice soft leather. Um, I haven't noticed any areas where the seams are breaking. You can see like right here, I don't know if the camera will even pick that up, if it can even focus on that, but there's a little seam right there that's a bit loose. It's not loose, it's just there's an extra piece of thread sticking out, but that seems to be about it as far as threads and stuff. Everywhere else it seems fairly evenly done, nicely square. Pretty good quality stitch work on the leather. Um, they did not, as you can see looking at this, you can see that they didn't get all the little punches completely through. There's a few where there's, like, there's one right there. Sometimes it's just the angle, but that's one. And then there's one here and one here where the punches did not go all the way through. And so there's those little leather circles in there, which would be easy to pop out. If it bothers you, you just take a little pen and just sort of push them and to the back because there's this liner in the way but you can still kind of work them loose and then they'll fall down and be gone so that you won't have those weird little spots in there but it's not really that big of an issue that does happen sometimes with leather it just means that they rushed through the production a bit the uh, dots are in a nice grid pattern pretty well done all in all, I think it's a pretty good quality bag at a reasonable price, and it's kind of cute and nice, so I like it. It's pretty simple, not ridiculously expensive, it seems to be made out of quality materials, and pretty well done.